In this problem, we need to find the orbital speed and the centripetal acceleration of the Earth as it orbits around the Sun in a circular orbit. Well, I'm going to start by drawing a diagram. This will be the Sun, and this will be the Earth in its orbit around. The Earth will have velocity, that will be tangent to the circle. This will be V, and we're solving for this. And that will also have a centripetal acceleration that will point inward. This will be AC, which is also what we're solving for. Well, I'll start with the centripetal acceleration. AC is equal to V squared over R, where R will be the radius that it's traveling, which will be the distance from the sun to the Earth, which it tells us is here. It's D of the sun, and it's 1.49 times 10 to the 11 meters. So I'll write D sun here. So now we need to find velocity. Well, F is equal to MA. We can plug that acceleration in there. We get F is equal to MV squared over D of the sun. And this uh, force is going to be the gravitational force because it's the only force that's going to be acting on the Earth. So gravitational force is G M. This will be the mass of the sun times the mass of the Earth. This will be over the distance between the sun and Earth, which will be D of the sun. This will be squared. And this will be equal to m, this is the mass of the Earth, because it's the object that's traveling. This comes from the uniform circular motion equation, so it'll be mass of the Earth times the velocity squared over d of the Sun. This will cancel, we'll be left with 1 d of the Sun on that side, and also the mass of the Earth will cancel. And we'll get that v squared is equal to g, the mass of the Sun, over the distance from the Sun to the Earth. Going to square root both sides, and we'll get that v is equal to the square root of g times the mass of the sun over the distance from the sun to the earth. So that's my answer for v. a will be this. I'll write a c. It'll be v squared, which will be the square root of g mass of the sun over distance of the sun. This whole thing will be squared. And this will be over d of the sun. So this triple acceleration will be equal to g mass of the sun over the distance of the sun squared. Now when you plug in all these numbers up here, you'll get that the triple acceleration is 0 0.006 meters per second squared. And that the orbital velocity is 30 kilometers per second. So those are your final answers. Thank you for watching.